just uh, employed me, so I'm new at this sort of game of talking about things, but here is a trailer with two boats on it attached to Sean's car. This has just come back from Swindon and it's still in one piece, which is a testament to the fact that it's reasonably put together. Things that you need to look for, make sure you haven't got too many loose ends. So this normally should have been tied up a bit better than that. Make sure all of these things are nicely tight. Everything tight. The keels are on here. Everything is nice and tight. Um, the trolleys are on the top. Just a little bit loose there, but it has come all the way down. Now what Sean does, he, after about five minutes down the road, he stops and checks it out. And we check it as we go. There's a little red light flashing in the, in the viewfinder if it's recording, okay? Uh, it's not flashing. Let's have a look. Is it there? Is it, is it There's recording? a red dot. That's recording. Okay. <laughs> okay. So we're going to show you in reverse order how to sort this lot out. So we'll do the unloading and the loading is the reverse. So what you're looking for is to make sure that it's all stable. Hold on Tony, could you do that again? I need to frame you up again. Yeah, okay. So you've got to make sure that everything is stable, nothing is moving. It's not shifting in any way whatsoever. Stop to the left. Oh yeah, okay. Is that no, that's, that's, it, that's as wide as we're going to get. That's as wide as you're going to get. Yeah, and is, is that far enough back? That's fine. That's that's fine. It's just a, um, that, that you haven't got me. I I just got your knees at the moment, and it's a wee knees and hands. This one. But it doesn't matter. No. You've got the voice. Yes, indeed. Okay. Press so, the go button. Okay. Okay. So again, this is in reverse order. So we have various things to look at. We've got the electrics, which is connected to the car electrics. We've got the jockey wheel which we'll lower and we've got the safety chain which we have to take off and then we can lift the whole thing off. So here we are, we're going to start doing that now. So we take off the electrics which is clear. We lower the jockey wheel to get it about there. Tighten it up. Taking off the safety chain. So we're now ready to lift, just checking this is tight, ready to lift it off. It should be reasonably easy to do, and it is. And we're down again. So we're now off the car. We can take the trailer away from the car. Loading up is the reverse of that. Okay. Right, okay, so we've now moved the trailer away from the car. We're ready to take the bits and pieces off. So, just want to draw your attention to how we hold it down. You can either use ropes, and that's okay, but you've got to be careful how you do it, or you can use these straps. The advantage of the straps, if you've got this ratchet device, you can put them in and just move it up and down, and it pulls it all down tight. Now, obviously, we're going to take it apart, taking the top one off first. When you're putting it together, you start with a bare trailer. First thing on are the keels. These are tied down again. Straps, you see the straps here. After we've got those on, we put the bottom boat on. Bottom boat, again, strap down. After we've done that, we put the masts on. And after that, the top boat, and the trolleys. Everything well and truly tied down. Got the button. It's a sound. Okay. I can start yeah. do the laughing. Okay. Can you be quiet? <laughs> <laughs> okay, so we've now got the lifting crew. They're probably off uh, off screen at the moment. So the first thing we do is take the straps off. Could you take the straps off, Ian? <laughs> Who tied these? Oh. 
Indeed. Now, the important thing is that these are tied up so that they don't flap about in the breeze and trail behind you and all the rest of it. You're recording. Okay, so we're, we're now unfastening at the front because the trolleys are held down at the front. We have taken off the straps at the top and the next move is to, once we've cleared the front, we take the trolleys off. So we've, we've now been very careful when we take the trolleys off not to damage the boat, obviously. So that's the first trolley out of the way. So we get this out of our system. So that Okay, go. Okay, are you pointing down at this? I'm pointing at you. Okay, so the boats have got painters on which are tied to the trolley down here and the painters stop the boats moving backwards. So we've got to take that painter off and while they're at it we'll take the other one off as well. Okay? Okay. Okay, so we're now lifting. Ideally we've got three people to doing it. We slide it off sideways, taking the white nice and evenly. We tilt it and drop it down onto the trailer, resting it on its side to start with. And then we pick it up and turn it over. Making sure that... Come take it back a little bit. Okay, and forward to press on the block at the front. And then we can use the painter to lash it all together. <laughs> okay. Okay, so the, the masts and the sail are lashed on here. Um, so we obviously haven't fastened them, but the sails are still wrapped around the mast. So there's a risk that um, the mast itself can slide back out of the sail. Um, so coming back here, now this gentleman here, Ian, has just taken this piece off. This is tied on to stop the mast itself going backwards. But he's jumped the gun. <laughs> is that it? Oh, the, the bungee oh. has gone. The bungee. The, yes, it... the bungee was around here holding it all together. Yeah. Like so. so we've taken that off. And as you can see, it's coming apart nicely now. And what we're going to do is to slide this lot gently out the back. And that will create space and access to get this bottom boat on. OK, go. OK, so we're now going to take... We'll slide the mass out very carefully, which gives us access to the bottom boat. It's important that we start with the bottom boat, then the mass, then the top boat. You want to get back a bit? I mean, you... you no, no, that's fine, that's fine. Are you okay? Yeah. Okay, so we're now taking the boom, booms off. There's two booms which we have fixed to the bottom boat because it's easy to do it that way. So it's one, one boom for the bottom, one boom for the top. They're well tied on. Oh, we're still rolling. You can actually do it with the booms on it. Well, no, I just want you to say it. Oh, the next okay. job is... I'm halfway there now. Okay. Yeah. And the next job is to, with people either side, to move it gently out, balancing it and put it on the trolley which is positioned behind us. No turning this time because it's the right way up. It does seem obvious, but it's better to have the big boat on the bottom. This is a 303, the boat which was on the top is a 2.3. Right. Okay. Okay, so... Actually, <laughs> so we've got to take it back. So gently, gently, gently resting until we can get into position. And again, gently, gently, gently. And again, resting the front of the boat on that wooden block. And we're checking that we're central and everything is fine. Paint are tied on. And that is boats off. The next action is the keels. And as you can see, the keels are again tied down with this locking device. Both sides. Okay. Stop, 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 stop. stop, stop, stop. You see, camp is tied, you get all excited. Oh, no. and... 
Okay, go. Okay, so we're now at the keel stage. Points to note, the keels are heavy at the bottom end, light at the top. Driver's preference as to which way around he has it, because it can help to balance the trailer. Um, this way around, heavy end at the front, because this driver likes it that way around. So we then have to unclip these, remove the straps, and then we've got to get them off. These are very heavy keels, and only fools try and lift the keel themselves as a one-person lift. Okay, go. Now the next job is to pick the keel up, and this is a heavy keel, and get it into the boat. So you need two strong men. Now I'm in charge of the commentary, so I don't want to interfere with this. I'll use the other two strong men to do it. So can two strong men come and get it off, show us how we do it, being very careful not to bang the keel on the trailer or drop it on the floor. And as you can see, it's heavy. There. Just rest it down. You can see that there are holes in the keel, and this is the pin to stop them. Making sure it goes in the right way round, lowering it gently, and the pin goes in the bottom hole. Okay, guys. Job done. Go. Okay, so we're starting now with the bear trailer. This is where we would normally come in. So if you can remember, we put the keels in, first job, strap them down, two keels. We then put the boat, we pick it off the trailer. Obviously the keel is on the trailer by now. We bring it in, we slide it forward, we strap it down. We tie it down at the front as well. Having got that in, the, we take the boom from the top boat, we strap it down to the bottom boat. Having got that strapped down, we put the masts in here, we strap them down. Having done that, we take the small boat on the top, pick it up off the trailer, turn it over, put it down on the top, strap it down. And the final job is the trolley, which go up onto the top boat, two trolleys upside down, strap them down. Put the paint is on, stop it going back. Stop, stop, stop. Wait for the noise to go past. Can you start from, um, let me recap where you were. You were, um, have you finished your operation? Not yet, two, we're, two we're, minutes, all, two we're, minutes. On, the, we're two on the final cut, I think. No, 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 oh, yeah, no, no, yeah, no, we're okay, we're... Um, I'm still running actually. Um, I don't know where you were when the, the noise started. So, so um, the final bit was you put the trolleys on top of the boat, okay. okay. So we, we've got the bottom boat on, we've got the masts on, we take the top boat, we turn it upside down, we put it on the top, we then put the trolleys on top, stomping down at every stage along the way. We then go to the painters at the front, tie those down, which will stop the boat moving back. And we put the straps on the masts to stop the masts themselves moving about, strap everything down, and then we give it all a really good shake and make sure it's okay. Then we connect the trailer to the car, electrics, safety wire, jockey wheel up, again give it a good shake. Once we've left the site, we go maybe a couple of miles and we stop in a lay-by and we check everything that nothing's moved on the first couple of miles. And, that, and that's how you do it. That's all there is to it folks. Uh, marks out of 10? Marks out of 10 for the... Um, <laughs> Well, uh, you mark us out of ten. Uh, we'll give you, we'll give you nine and a half. Okay. Nine and a half. <laughs>